Ladies, welcome everybody aboard the Waterbug Tour today. My name's Captain Johnny Dignan. I'll be your captain and guide. As we go along, we'll be telling you a little bit about local areas and local wildlife. So if you have any questions, you would raise your hand and I'll try to answer the best I can. Captain Johnny Dickinson is taking another group of passengers out to see the sights along Beaufort's waterfront on his water bug tours. We just left Beaufort. Beaufort's the third oldest town in North Carolina behind Bath and New Bern. It was settled in 1709 and incorporated in 1722. Well, we start out to tell them a little bit of history about the town of Beaufort, and then we get out and start talking about the Rachel Carson Reserve. They have a lot of history, nature, and wildlife here, and a lot of people like to come to see the horses. You look right up here ahead of us, you see this land mass here that's part of the Rachel Carson Reserve. Rachel Carson Reserve consists of five Barry Island areas, and on those islands you have 28 horses. You look right here ahead of us, you see two of the 28 horses. They were brought here in the early 1600s, 1700s and got shipwrecked here on the islands here and been living here ever since. We see dolphin a lot of times on the way. We have over 250 uh, species of birds we watch along the shore. You never tell them, you might see a sea turtle pop up. It's just hard to say what you're going to see on our trips. The tours last from 45 minutes to an hour, depending on how often passengers want to stop to take pictures. Oh, I love it. They're, they're very um, thorough and informative. It's an easy ride, and it's not too long, so you can actually bring, I brought my two-year-old granddaughter on it. All the touristy events in Beaufort are so fun, so it's a great thing to do when my relatives come in or guests come in from out of town. And it's, a, it's not too expensive, and it's a, just a nice little cruise down the Taylor's Creek, so I like to do that. We use a lot of floating docks in the area here because the tide rises about three, three and a half foot. In addition to talking about the area's history, geography, wildlife, and notable landmarks, Captain Dickinson shares his local knowledge too. He tells passengers about Beaufort's 200 homes on the National Register of Historic Places, and he talks about how the real estate trends have changed over the decades. Up to about 60 years ago, hardly anybody wanted to live on the waterfront except for your commercial fishermen. But since then, as you can tell over here on the front street of Beaufort here, you can see the houses closed in here quite tightly. And it's caused the property value to be quite high over here on the waterfront of Beaufort. Dickinson is a bit of a water bug himself. Well, I used to tournament water ski. We used to tournament fish for King Michael and just, just vacation and go out to camp out on the islands here. I've been on the water all my life. Uh, started out with a five horsepower motor back when I was about 10, but I love being on the water. Dickinson's tours also help tourists plan their visit. You have the Battery Inn restaurant right here, and right next to that you have the Front Street Grill at Stillwater, both nice restaurants. We get a lot of people from all up the eastern seaboard and a lot of people from Ohio, Virginia, and even Michigan and over in the Midwest. We're coming back in here to the dock. I get the enjoyment of talking to different people find out where they're from. I want them to know a lot about Beaufort. I mean, Beaufort is a nice little town. All right, thank you for going with us today. Hope you had a good time. Enjoy the rest of your vacation here on the Crystal Coast and in Beaufort. Waterbug Tours is located at 610 Front Street in Beaufort. Monday through Saturday, tours leave on the hour from 1015 to 515, and on Sundays from 1115 to 515. For more information, call 252 342-3577 or go to waterbugtours.com.